All right, here he comes. I need to keep my main boy hydrated here, brother. Of course. Because you're the man for that. Oh, are you pro? That is pro level. How are you? You all right? Oh, mate, I can't tell you the love I have for that. So we're rolling here. Oh, right? we're, really? Yeah. Tommy, big day today. Big day. So for you at home who are wondering what's going on here, you've got to put your belt on, brother. Oh, yeah, that's me. We've got, mate, we've got Every safety Thursday morning. Issues. Every Thursday morning I pick up Sammer and we go to Future Sammer Studios and we like to maximise our time. Of course we do. And so what we're going to do every Thursday is on our way to the studios is we're going to do a little uh, show we're calling Now, Soon, Later. Yeah. So we're going to pick a topic and we're just going to talk about what's happening now, what's going to be happening soon and then the consequences of all that and what's going to happen later. Today, we read a story about uh, our mates at Lilium in Germany who just uh, tested a five-seater passenger drone. Wow. They didn't put humans in it, but they sent it up. There are a lot of doubters. A lot of people think flying taxis is the talk of the Jetsons, right? But this is the first real evidence that we are going to start seeing flying taxis in the sky. Well, Tommy, can I just remind everyone yeah. of the horseless carriage? If you look back... 200 years ago, people were saying this horseless carriage idea, it's a pipe dream. No chance of us ever having a micro scale autonomous car that doesn't need a horse, right? Well, it was 150 years of them talking about it before it happened. Right. Okay, so we've been talking about flying cars kind of since the 50s or 60s. And we're about 70 years, and it's almost exactly half as long as it took us to get the horseless carriage. It's real, and it's almost exactly on schedule. You know what's really different about this time? Is that you don't need infrastructure. Yeah, you, know, you know the beautiful the thing about it, you don't need roads. Where we're going, Tommy, we don't need roads. So, if that's happening now, these things are in the air, fully electric, vertical takeoff and landing, Sammer. What can we start seeing soon? Okay. Soon, big prediction here, Tommy. I reckon before the end of 2020, 14, 16 months away, we're going to see these air taxis available for you and me. What? And here's how it's going to work. It's going to be point to point. You're not going to be able to fly anywhere. And my prediction is city to airport. City to airport. And I think it's the ideal place to start us going to the skies. But there are consequences. So now we look at flying taxis and we look at later. Later is going to get very interesting, isn't it? Because this highway we're driving on now totally becomes redundant. And this is what I call a technology curve jump. Everyone's touting the potential for autonomous vehicles. I think the biggest threat to autonomous vehicles is autonomy in the sky. How many human initiated fatalities are there on the road? Well, there are more than a million every year and 99% of them are caused by human error. Whoa. There we go, sorry Jack. Okay. That's okay, see? Autonomous vehicle, that wouldn't have happened. You've only got two eyes. The autonomous vehicle, 300 Thanks, eyes. Mate. You let us in now. Yeah. There's not enough layers of redundancy in these aircraft yet. Yeah. That's the number one concern. If they just say, it works, trust us, that's not enough for me. Sure. It's yeah. not just, oh, so the software bug crashed. Can, oh, bug can be so, fatal. Yeah, bugs can be fatal. But Death by glitch. Death by glitch, is that yours? <laughs> Mate, just go. You ready? Yeah. Later, all automobile manufacturers will be in the sky. There will be very few cars that individuals have on the ground. Most of the vehicles on the ground will be forms of mass autonomous transport that we all get into. And the only ground transport will be public transport. It's interesting stuff. Boomtown. Tune in. Don't miss it. It's now. It's Tommy and it's Samatron, and we're going to drop the bombs, the truth, baby. It's going to make you dominate the boardroom. You know you can.